All right, guys. Today is toward the end of June. I don't even know the exact date. 20 something Sunday. Uh, we are floating a new stretch of river. This is a river I fish quite a bit, but I've never done this eight mile section. Up here, there's a lot more boulders, smallmouth, and goggle eye. Today, I'm hoping to get on a big smallmouth, like a three pounder. And it'd be nice to get an accidental walleye or white bass or crappie or whatever. But my main target is giant smallmouth. We are floating without a motor, just a paddle. We are floating eight miles, seven to eight miles down using swim baits and crank baits. Come along with us and see what happens. Hit like 50 times, but they're sunfish. Oh, that one ain't. <laughs> God, he went airborne. Is that a looks like a mean mouth almost, doesn't it? Kinda, honey. I think it's a spotted, but they look they always look kind of brown in here. All right, guys, first fish of the day. Caught him on a chartreuse pulsar with a pink and white head. A little spotted bass, about eight inches. A little rodent. One even that deep. It was just a little eight inch small mouth, but I would have been happy to get him. Oh God, oh God, oh my God. Broke my line. Broke my line. Did you see it? What did I have? It was a giant small mouth, I think. It was either that or that buffalo. Well, here we go. About to find out. Well, looks like I'm getting wet already. Yeah, goes downhill a lot. Too swift to fish, though. It's too swift to fish. You ain't gonna catch nothing. Yeah, we're knocking this off our list though. We may turn this around. We may end up doing good. We still got a lot of time. It could turn around for us. We could get to one hole and catch four or five in one hole. You never know. Didn't get much of a chance. like above Keener Springs, that's where they're at in the summer, the walleye. Not in the... You got one? Yeah. Alright, Wilma's on one, probably a walleye. It probably is. I got the dip net ready. If you get him, get him back here. No, you got a drum. Well, at least it's a fish. Alright, guys. Wilma's on a... Ah, I gotta get... Watch out. Oh, 
Oh, wonderful, wonderful. Why'd we even use the dip net, seriously? At a bad time like this, trying to get through trees and... Oh, hold on. All right, guys, this drum she caught's really yellow. Hold him up for us like regular. You can do it without turning around. Now move your arm that way real bad, yeah. Now turn the tail towards me. There you go. All right, so guys, she caught this trolling a crankbait. About a one pound drum. We're happy to get anything at this point. All right. It's holding this just not real well. Any swifter, it would have been not worth it. All right, guys, I got my second fish of the day. It looks like an identical twin to the spotted bass, except this is a largemouth, a real largemouth. We've gotten two of these, a little eight inch bass, and she got the drum, and she's hung again. God, we just keep getting hung. This is a very, very snaggy river, and I was getting ready to throw it right back too. Now I can't. Oh, I just had a hit. There he is. Got it. Yes. And seriously, is that all I'm going to catch today? That's three of these. Way out in the middle, eight foot down. I counted to eight before I started reeling in. He was barely hooked to, guys. That is my third fish, and they've all been identical. Eight inches. Nothing. Everything that was awesome has gotten off, broke my line or whatever. Got another one. Yes, four eight inch bass guys. Oh, this guy's nine. Oh, <laughs> four bass today for me and one drum for her. We are catching something here and there though at least. It's another little guy. I got him on the Tennessee Shad. Suicide Shad with a fire tiger. Jig head. Yeah, he's eight or nine inches again. I don't know what the deal is, guys. They're, they're biting, but only the ones that are small that are willing to bite. There's definitely a few fish along this spot. You got one? You got a fish. Oh my goodness. Um, oh. Got it. Oh man. All right guys, she just caught a short nose gar. Oh my. Whoa, not easy to get either. Let me watch my poles for me. The main concern, watch my poles. Not a happy camper, are you? You're not happy, are you? You're in a dip net, for God's sakes. guys nice little short nose about 18 to 20 inches is it zoomed mm -hmm. it's fine you don't need to zoom all right i'm gonna get him back in where he cuts my arm his armor cuts my hands oh 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 it's big it's big oh he's got me hung oh 
Finally, a nice large mouth. Dip net, dip net. That's a real, oh, I'm in my, yeah, I was in my crankbait. All right, a real large mouth. Hey, he's not that bad. <coughs> Did he come off? Oh no, he didn't. All right, guys, I got a nice large mouth for this river anyway. A little over a pound, pound a third. Not gonna complain because it has been slim pickings today. All right, don't move for a minute. Do not move. I guess there ain't enough stuff in here for this to stand up good. All right, guys, I got him back in this little bay. Little side quiet pocket back in here. Typical largemouth hideout. Do not move. Got him on the suicide shad, Tennessee shad. All right. Well, guys, I guess this is the day of the dinks. <laughs> Every fish is tiny except her gar. The, even the drum. Oh, I caught the one okay bass. But the majority of the only fish willing to bite is the ones that are under 10 inches, it seems like. I got him on a Lunker City orange and yellow with an orange and yellow VMC moon eye. Pretty cool looking setup there really small he's only seven pathetic pickerel i'm hung whoa what do you got oh it's in the tree i think it's a white bass you had a white bass. Oh. No, it's a large mouth. Oh man. Oh, grab him by the lip. All right guys, Wilma got a nice, real large mouth. Over in this calm side of the river channel where a spring comes in. Not bad at all. And he's pretty decent. <coughs> Let me zoom. Here, I'm going to zoom in on you. Guys, we've caught two nice largemouth today, one one for each person. Other than that, it's been a rough day. The morning had a good, pretty good morning bite, but we kept missing. Everything seems to keep getting on. There you go. That's not too bad. Uh, you keep looking at me. All right, yay. On the crankbait? No, I don't want it. You're lucky you got him. All right, guys, attack of the seven and eight inch spotted basses once again. <laughs> that is all we can seem to get the bite, and a couple gar. She caught another gar when my battery was dead. And it's, other than that, it's Slim Pickens. What a little fella, my God. Embarrassing. What'd I tell you? All right, guys, finally a real fish. We have worked all day for this fish. He's about nine inches. 
That's a nice shadow bass. As soon as I pulled it, I just mentioned to her, I said, I know there's goggle line here, and sure enough, look at that one, honey. Oh, not bad. That's a nice goggle line. Try not to move all up. All right, guys, I finally got something worth catching. About a nine inch shadow bass. Heck yeah. You want to keep it or no? Huh? You want to hold it? Or look at it again? It's not bad, is it? That's a nice one there. Sure did. We both got, each got our own large mouth and each caught a nice goggle eye. Hers is about seven. Let me get a picture of you here. Lay my I'm gonna zoom in on you. Alright, I'm zoomed. I don't lose him. Oh, it feels good back here. Not bad, honey. Let me zoom more. You turn your bot or something. Oh, I got your arm and a fish. Uh, turn around or something. I want to get good views of these fish because we haven't caught a whole lot of good ones. Okay, show your face. Alright, go. Alright guys, first walleye of the day. And I'm really risking it. I got six pound line on this pole. I knew there'd be one sitting in here. Boy, something finally turned into our favor. He's a little 15 incher, but I do not care. I'm happy to get a walleye. I got him on the missile shock wave. No, he's about 16 or 17. Oh yeah, now that turned our day around just a little bit, guys. Do not make any sudden movements. All right, guys, I'm gonna get him back in. Nice little walleye. Not quite eating size. I dropped him four times. <laughs>